Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamu alaikum this is Asad Yaqub and once again I welcome you to my IELTS video in this video I'm going to tell you the difference between British Council and IDP as many of you frequently ask me this question sir what is the difference between British Council and IDP which one is better where can we get better band score and all that stuff let me tell you IELTS is the property of Cambridge University right I mean IELTS actually belongs to Cambridge University but IELTS has two main partners and these two main partners are British Council and IDP now these two partners British Council and IDP they help Cambridge University conduct their IELTS test because Cambridge University uh, does not conduct IELTS test directly. They, they take help from British Council and IDP. So now these are actually the partners. IDP and British Council, they are the partners. There are several questions about it. Some students believe that if you take your IELTS test from IDP, you can get better band score. On the other hand, some students believe that if you take your IELTS test from British Council, they have strict examiners, marking criteria is strict uh, or it's more strict as compared to IDP. But let me tell you, all these are myths. Let's see what is British Council. British Council is a charitable organization. It is registered as charity in London, right? And they conduct this test. Now, whenever you take your IELTS test from British Council, all your writing, whether you take paper delivered or computer delivered, all your writing tasks are scanned, right? And then they are uploaded onto a portal. Okay, same is the case with your speaking. Your speaking test is recorded and it is uploaded to a portal. Same is the case with your listening and uh, reading uh, answer sheets. They just scan those answer sheets and then those answer sheets are uploaded onto a portal. Now, what happens if you take your IELTS test from British Council? Uh, there may be some difference of mechanism the way they conduct the test but it is almost the same British Council provides headphones for listening IDP provides headphones for listening they have somehow same standards because these standards are Cambridge University standards but actually when you take your IELTS test from British Council your writing tests are marked by examiners in England Whereas when you take your IELTS test from IDP, International Development Program, when you take it from there, IDP belongs to Australia, right? So then your uh, writing tasks are marked by examiners in Melbourne, Australia. So this is the difference. On the other hand, criteria is same. Both give you low band score in, re in writing. Okay, I tell you, both have tendency to give you low band score in speaking. Right. There are several cases of EOR inquiry on results and the outcome is positive on both British Council and IDP. Now, some students believe if you take your IELTS test from British Council, it is easier as compared to IDP. It is just a myth. If British Council and IDP, they conduct IELTS test on the same day, same time, same country, the test is same. There is no difference in the test as well. On the other hand, some students believe if you take your IELTS from British Council, then in listening, they have British English. On the other hand, if you take your IELTS from IDP, then in listening, they have Australian English. Let me tell you in IELTS listening, we have a variety of dialects of English language. Whether you take it from British Council or, uh, or uh, IDP, they have British accent, American accent, Australian accent, Canadian accent, uh, Irish accent, North American accent. Okay, so there is a variety, but the language that they speak that language is actually standard English, right? Both bodies charge almost the same amount of money uh, as their fee. Now, you know what happens? Someone appears from British Council and he gets his desired band score and then he starts saying British Council is better. On the other hand, someone gets poor result from British Council, right? And then he goes to IDP and there 
the test is easier or maybe some other thing happens like that or he is better prepared and then he gets better bench from IDP then he starts saying IDP is better than British Council or British Council is better than IDP but let me tell you both are same right if you feel comfortable taking your IELTS test from and I advise you if once you take your IELTS test from British Council or from IDP and you don't get your desired band score and you are planning to take it again then I advise you to change your test center because changing your test center will give you a different feeling different feeling means British Council and IDP somehow people are different venues are different okay interior is different examiners are different so this difference will give you a new feeling and you will just have a feeling that you are taking your IELTS test all over again one thing on the other hand students frequently ask me this question if I take my IELTS test from one city or from another city or that city is densely populated more more students take IELTS test they give less bench score that city is not densely populated there are few people in that city that means better bench score if I take my IELTS from a remote test center I will get good, good bench score not at all that is not true let me tell you your IELTS writing will be marked by uh, examiners in England if it is British Council and IDP if it is uh, uh, Australia and if it is uh, IDP so you don't need to worry about that yes listening and reading that is also marked by the markers in England and in Australia okay so hardly it is speaking speaking bench score is given by local examiners but still they have recording of that speaking so this is all the stuff so you take it from any country any state any city it's going to be the same these things will not affect your bench score the only thing that affects your bench score is your preparation if you prepare well you will get good bench score regardless of British Council or IDP and all that so be confident if you have booked your IELTS test date from British Council well done or if you have booked your IELTS test date from IDP even then it is all right you don't have to worry about anything both are same they are controlled by Cambridge University so don't worry the standards are same Cambridge standards and you can get your desired band if you are capable of doing that okay guys thank you very much if you have any further information about your experience related to IDP or British Council sometimes you know students commonly believe that if we take our IELTS test from IDP speaking examiners are friendly right if we take our IELTS test from British Council speaking examiners are not very friendly so it's not the examiners now if someone has a bad experience at IDP will say IDP is not good I mean you cannot stereotype IDP just on the basis of one bad experience in the same way if someone goes to IDP and the examiner is very friendly the person will say IDP examiners are very friendly they are very cooperative and all that same is the case with British Council there can be like one or two examiners which may give bad experience or who may give bad experience to the students otherwise students end up with good experience and all that so if you know any further about IDP or British Council uh, you should comment this video so that others get to know because my students regularly read the comments which are given below my video. So please don't forget to comment about your experience about your knowledge and according to you which one is better British Council or IDP all the best guys I also teach IELTS online if you want to join my online arts classes my whatsapp number is given you can contact me for that Asad Yaqub truly wishes you best of luck take good care of yourselves Allah Hafiz